without having to get all dirty. Now this is your wet bay area, okay, and here you've got a filtration system as well, okay. You can also uh, turn on your cargo lights, your water pump, there's a 12 volt outlet out here. Uh, there's a sandy flush system that can help you get rid of your different water tanks. Uh, you've got your black water, gray water, and waste water uh, bypass valves all here. You've got an outside shower here in case you ever want to rinse off outside without tracking dirt or mud into the coach. Um, you've also got a hot water drain as well. And then they throw a power paper towel rack and a light as well on this for you. So everything's very neat. Uh, you can also uh, monitor all your tanks from right out here as well. Fresh water, gray water, and black. Fresh water is obviously your fresh water. Gray would be your water from your sink and from your shower. And your black would be from your uh, toiletries. Now this is your Aqua Hot 600D system, Frank. This is going to give you your continuous hot water uh, so that you can take multiple showers back to back with e without ever having to run out of hot water. You also uh, can uh, heat the coach with this, and it can generally run off of electric and or propane if you needed it to, if you're in uh, cold climates. There's another storage bay for you. Here's the other side of that, uh, those two small manual slide-out trays. That one is in, the other one was out. And then here's the other side of that... Uh, electric slide out tray and again with this electric slide when I hit this button on this side it can come out this way and this is your fuse panel box uh, there's also an air service line located right there you can see so you've got an air chuck and there's that gen slide out button where you can slide that generator in and out if you need to. There's that quiet Cummins Onan 12,500. You can start the generator from out here as well if you need to. It'll also list the hours on it as well. And now we're going to move inside the coach. You'll notice the wipers are mounted up high, not down in the way, in the sight of vision. As we go into the coach, you'll notice that your front steps are chromed off and your interior steps are also corianned off and lighted as well. Captain's chairs, probably the most comfortable furniture in any coach. And over here in your driver compartment, what you've got is all your different buttons, your rear view audio. These chairs also uh, massage as well, so as you're driving down the road you can get a little massage. That's your uh, hydraulic, your jack system, your monitoring system for all your different gauges, your Allison transmission, all your various buttons, smart wheel where you can operate your radio and windshield wipers and things like that from the uh, from the steering wheel. You'll notice uh, two screens there. One will be the radio, GPS. The other one will be your backup monitoring system. 
You can operate your gen, your hood lights, your dome lights, your coach lights, your radio, gen start, all that good stuff from right up here. Again, in the Heritage, you have the multiplex wiring system, which is basically one touch for your shades, your lights, etc., etc. You can turn them all on or off or put all the shades up or down as you see fit. Passenger chair also. Here's your cabinetries your surround sound system large Sony TV right up front here's looking at the driver's side of the coach couch on one side kitchen you can see that full wall slide really makes a huge difference in the width of the coach I love the detail that they put in the coach. Genair electric cooktop. Again, if you look at the detail, the handcrafted detail on the Heritage Frank is absolutely beautiful. Residential style faucetries. Solid surface granite type countertops. Plenty of galley space. That's your dishwasher there. You'll notice toe kick lighting there down at the bottom. stainless steel appliances for the microwave and there's your residential style refrigerator with ice maker washer and dryer next to that in that vented slot and pantries of course There's that booth style seating I told you about. Very comfortable. Villa furniture in the Heritage, which is the best furniture you can get. It's very soft and supple. Very, very comfortable. Again, you can operate lights from right here. Love the decor packages. Your blinds are all push button automatic, one touch, as well as your lights. Your flooring. There's your entertainment center in the middle of the coach. And your ceiling treatments as well. Moving to the mid bath here. Cabinetries above. Again, continuing the custom work in the bathrooms.